Hello, hello! I'm Marco, CTO and co-founder of Memgraph, and today I'm going to present Memgraph 2.1, which can be downloaded at memgraph.com slash download. The reason why we did the release is because expanding and polishing data ingestion into the Memgraph platform makes it very easy for users to get new data in and ensure that the process is smooth and enjoyable all the way through. What we actually did is to polish the experience of existing data sources, but also add a couple of new ones like Apache Pulsar and Red Panda. And last but not least, we improved the communication protocol and as it's always the, the case with new releases, uh, there are a couple of bug fixes. On the Kafka improvement side, there is now the ability to control the offset of the next consumed message by calling Kafka set stream offset procedure and providing stream name and the offset. There is also the ability to configure bootstrap server via query on the fly by adding bootstrap servers option to the create stream clause. As mentioned, there are two new streaming data sources, Apache Pulsar and Red Panda. Apache Pulsar is a multi-tenant high-performance solution for server-to-server -server messaging. On the other side, Red Panda is Kafka-compatible streaming platform for mission-critical workloads. Adding these two is great because uh, now you can attach more data sources and build your graphs out of that and run graph analytics on, on, on top of them. On the protocol improvement side, there is now support for Bolt 4.3, which has some main, minor updates in Handshake and versioning. More importantly, there is now support for server-side notifications, uh, which can inform you about results or give you some useful tips. Maybe the most interesting thing is execution statistics as a part of the query summary. Uh, as you can see here, if you execute a query, the stats will contain how many labels were added or how many relationships were created. Overall, this is Memgraph platform. As you can see here, there are now Apache Pulsar and Red Panda. It's important to emphasize that Memgraph now contains these two clients, uh, Kafka and Pulsar. That's important because there is no need to build custom microservices to transform data and put it into Memgraph, or there is also no need to, uh, to install these clients manually or deal with them in, in any way, which might, be, which might be tricky and time consuming. On the protocol side, it's important to support the latest protocol because by doing so, all your applications can stay up to date but also all the existing tools from the ecosystem can connect to Memgraph and leverage graph data. And that's it. Uh, join our community uh, on memgraph.com or ask question on discourse.memgraph.com and also uh, Discord, our, our chat. And GitHub is always an option if you want to find more details or even contribute if that's an option for you and uh, you think that that might be helpful. And that's it. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Please make sure to like this video and hit the subscribe. And see you next time. Bye-bye.